uh, we're broadcasting from the um, Leonardo Business Breakfast, um, hosted by Bain Me and the Zionist Federation. Uh, welcome to Jewish Online Magazine. Pleasure being here. Um, can I begin by asking you, the Mayor of Jerusalem is campaigning for the release of Jonathan Pollard. Uh, now Hillary Clinton has left the political scene, do you think this is going to be a realistic situation? Uh, well, we hope and pray uh, that Jonathan Pollard, who's been in jail for uh, 27 and a half years now, will be able to uh, live as a free man with, with his wife in Jerusalem, that the President of the United States can be persuaded to have compassion on him. Uh, we have to realistically have our doubts because of the many times our hopes have been raised before, but um, it should be interesting to see whether Perez, who has a good relationship with Obama, uh, is able to persuade him. Do you think the Obama visit to Israel is going to pave the way for his release, or do you think it is a political pawn? Look, realistically, uh, Obama has not shown compassion in the past. Uh, he's had on his table a formal request for clemency now for four years, and uh, he has not addressed the issue at all, and yet... Obama is coming to Israel in order to reach out to the people of Israel. And if there's any issue that's become a consensus issue in Israel, it's that. And why do you think it's taken so long for Obama to come to Israel as President of the United States? Well, Obama did come four years ago as a candidate for President of the United States. I was there. Um, and uh, then he was waiting for the right time, and the right time never came, in part because of his own policies that distanced Israel away from him. And so now it's the beginning of a second term, and he wants to start off on the right foot, and that's a lot better than he did last time. And um, do you think the Netanyahu-Obama relationship is going to be fruitful with this visit? Well, it can't be worse than it was before, I don't think. And now uh, both of them are going to make an effort in order to make it fruitful for the benefit of both countries. I'm very proud to be a citizen of both Israel and the United States, and the leaders of both countries need to get along for the good of each other and uh, for the citizens of both countries. Being cynical, why do you think he's coming to Israel? Uh, look, I, I, Obama's coming to Israel because Israelis don't like him and he needs to fix it. That, that's why he's coming, and good luck.